I'm back again, man. This is Mark Anthony Tarantino. Found on most social medias that way. We're about to go do another restaurant review, y'all. Let's go. seriously eat here like way too much bro this spot yeah this exact one bro like i'm seriously eating here probably once once a week bro i was doing bad like twice a week for a while but i went vegetarian man this is a good spot to be vegetarian at for sure and i'm back on the meat now so i'm really excited man i like this place how long did you do the vegetarian thing for um the longest the longest vegetarian run i've ever been on man was uh two years and then um, the last one, before this last time, was a year. And then this one was only six to eight months. I usually like to go vegetarian in the wintertime, man, because the barbecue season's over, you know? Yeah. But this is good, man. It makes you feel good in life in general, bro. Cutting a lot of that meat out and the processed shit, bro. Makes sense. So this is your first time eating here? Yeah, I haven't ate here since it was the sushi spot. I think I'm gonna try something that I usually don't eat here so I can give a fair review. Usually I just come here and get the, the seafood pho or I get the, the vegetarian seafood pho. But. So let's do. This is my problem every time I come in here, bro. I'm gonna get the seafood pho. <laughs> and then I'll take a, a soda as well. Yeah. Oh, you have Mandu? Yes. Can I get uh, the Kung Pao ramen? Can you make it? Uh, let's do. Let's do. Let's do chicken today, man. Chicken. Let's see if I get an appetite. Do it for the video. Do it for the video. You want to try any appetizers, bro? You pick. Cause my my movements is slow when it comes to picking food. An appetizer? Yeah. Pot stickers, one time. That's a good one. Let's get the. We'll go with the pot stickers. Okay. Dig it in, man. Shit, it's out of the way. Turn that shit off. So you want to introduce what we're eating? Man, this, I mean, this is the pot stickers they got right here. I, I, I don't think I had these before, actually, so it's going to be my first time trying it, too. I'm real excited. They say it's always good to rinse your palate out before you eat some food with some water, so we got that. Let's try it out, man. I've eaten a lot of pot stickers, man. This is pretty good, man. I like the crunch, the texture. Uh, I mess with this, man. We didn't even put the sauce on it yet. What you did? It's got a nice crunch. I'm not a huge pot sticker person, so I don't know why I picked this. But uh, I would eat these again. He's trying to go in the hatred mode, I think. He's going to go, hey, I don't know. I'm going to pot I'm going to get those, though. <laughs> well, these are good. I would order them again. Let's see what we got over here, man. Sauce on it. Mmm. That sauce is, is pretty light, man. It's not too salty. Sometimes you get the sausage, man. It's killed with the salt, man. Yeah, this is good. I got it's got the nice crunch on the edges, nice and soft in the middle. This is my first time really ever eating fried pot stickers. Usually I get them uh, uh, steamed on a pan. Man, I don't know what that is, but that's how we order from the, from the restaurants. You see the delivery coming through, man. Delivery, um, food, it, it's hit or miss, man. It's hit or miss. Is there anything you don't like about it? I felt like it could be a little less shiny on me. Okay. A little less shiny. A little less shiny, man. That's, that's, you know, I mean, shiny's always good, but a little less is always better. 
What about you? Uh, I don't know. To be honest, like it's a pretty to me, it's a pretty good pasta. Like, I'm not a huge fan of pasta stickers, but it's pretty good. So it's, it's hard for me to find something I don't like about it, just because I would eat it again when I don't even like pasta stickers. Impressed. I go with impressed, man. But I'm not surprised. I eat here a lot. So. This is first time in. First time. Silverware. Chopsticks today? Yeah. All right. Traditional style, baby. Check this real quick. Perfect. You can put that stuff in there too if you like it, man. They usually go, they're, they're, they're being a little tight today on the, on the garnishments because I usually don't use it. <laughs> See what this is about. First time, fair to, I'm gonna give you one pointer, man. I know, I know you're familiar, but they say if you stab your chopsticks in the soup, that's disrespect. I mean, you want to murder. I read that somewhere about four restaurants. So be careful, y'all. Be careful when you do that. So this is the Kung Pao chicken. First time eating it, man. Hopefully it's nice and spicy. I like it, man. I usually like to knock it out with nothing on it so I can tell if the cook did a good job or not. It's got real nice flavor. Start off sweet. You can feel the heat picking up a little bit. The rest is up for you guys to try now. Mm. Soup is really good. Is this your first time eating pho? No. Okay. But uh, I've had it from a couple spots. In comparison, what do you think, man? Uh, so far, let me try some of the meat in here. So this is a seafood, seafood pho, right? And yeah. It's got uh, shrimp. Um, Scallops, uh, squid, I think that's it, right? Yeah. Veggies. Uh, I don't know, what is that? The uh, pink one, though. what is that right there? Put that what is that? I don't know what that is. Oh, yeah. what, what is this right here? That is a seafood meatball, so it's like pretty much shrimp. Um, oh, okay. And a meatball. I think it's really good. It's my favorite. Seafood meatball, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. okay. Meatball to see, y'all. Yeah. Meatball to see. <laughs> meatball to see. There's some carrots in here. Some veggies, okay. I make a pretty big mess, man, but before I got started, you can just take a look. I'm not that good at naming my vegetables. I got the purple salad, the green salad, the orange carrots, you know what I mean? Gotcha. Take care of y'all, man. Good. Seafood meatball just tastes like some seafood. It almost tastes like some fish. Um, I would say it's very delicious. It's very flavorful. Uh, the only thing that uh, I'm missing here compared to some other pho that I've, I've, I've had, is uh, the spice level. Um, I would like it a little bit more spicy. I'll put all the jalapenos they put it on here, and uh, I would like a little bit more spicy. But other than that, I like the flavor. Oh uh, yeah, a little bit. I should have told you, man, because they'll, they'll blast the heat in here too, man. Normally, I ask for a yeah. super hot. Thank you. Mm -hmm. But as well, I would say it's not as hot as I usually come to get. And I'll tell you what, I don't mess with these, bro. I do not mess with these. Put that to the side right there. They get dangerous now, okay. Stir it up a little bit. 
Heated up enough? They got a special powder back there too. They don't like to tell the name of it, but that one's straight fire, bro. You try some of that? <laughs> a powder? Yeah. She won't, she won't tell me the ingredient that it actually is, bro. She's like, nah, it's my secret. I don't want nothing and I don't know what it is. <laughs> That's a good choice, man. Well, I'll tell you what, two little pinches like that. It's bad, bro. It's probably that secret ingredient from the uh, noodles you was eating last time. Probably. I will say this. As I got an older man, I'm somewhat of a picky eater, and I hate to change up when I know something is good. I don't dab out and try new things, man. I can surprise him a new thing. But this, I, I probably would order this again, man. Um, I like it, man. But like you said, man, it'd be a little heat. That, that might help, though. I want, drop some of that in there. I want some heat, but I'm leaving that on the side, though, huh? <laughs> How many scoops you put in there? Two. I'm going to go four in there. <laughs> One. Ooh, no, nah, I'm gonna go two, bro. This is these are big two, man. Man, fuck it, it's grow, man. Hope I didn't kill my food now, y'all. I might have just killed my whole meal right here. Yeah, you better mix that up oh, good. Yeah, I'm not biting that like that, bro. Ooh, that smells hot, bro. I think I might have went too far, bro. I think I did it for the views, though. I might have went too far. Might be good. Oh, so. I'm gonna stare it in good for sure. I really like 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 the peanuts in here, man. I just I don't like that. I hear the man's nose running already. Yeah. That's what you about to be. You know, I have a little bit congested lately, so this might help. Just make sure. It's all bleach on the stick now, so you know I'm getting a nasty hot one right there. Might not be too bad. Might need another pull. Keep staring this up, man. I got my kid, my food looking like I'm, like I'm a six year old again, bro. It's all mixed together now. <laughs> Let's drop another one to one. Oh. Yeah, sure. it, it might not be hot right now, but I'm pretty sure later it will be. Jose ain't gonna show me a day, buddy. Another two. Another two. I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm ruining my food, but we're going to see. I ain't going to drink no water either. Watch. Oh, you're going to taste the spice. No flavor of the food, but spice. Oh, yeah, it's cool, bro. That's what I like. Mm, I'm smelling a little spicy now. Keep staring it up. Let's see if we hit my level. We got six scoops. I'm six deep right now. <laughs> That's a level right there, boy. That's a different level right there. Clear that? Yeah. Sinus is cleared up officially. With one bite. Yeah. Oh yeah. Sounds good. Looks real good now. I'm clear and free, baby. Yeah. Clear and free. No water. No water right now. Water makes it worse, I feel like, man. You drink that water, man. It just, I don't know, man. It doesn't help at all. Water? Yeah. Well, you know, let me ask you this, bro. I've eaten spicy food my whole life. I feel like the one thing that helps, bro, kind of helps, is milk, right? But I got a little technique. I got a little sugar in the milk. 
Yeah. And it kind of like a, a bootleg horchata. And then that helps a lot. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? What, what, what would you say would, would, would stop the burning that I'm feeling right now? I don't know what stops it because I, don't, I can't say milk does because I don't drink milk. But uh, the thing that works for me is to keep on eating. Mm. That reminds me when I used to eat Cheetos, bro. I was a little kid. So you stop eating that Cheetos, bro, you're on fire, bro. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I don't know, you should have done that one. No, nah, I'm taking that out, bro. We at that part out, bro. We ain't wrong with that. We ain't, ooh. We ain't wrong with that one. That was, that was the one right there, bro. If I pass out, bro, please call 911, man, because high blood pressure, man. High blood pressure. It looks like he fucked his life, though. That was so hot, bro. I had to keep eating that. What are you talking about? Mm. You're getting a little red over there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Y'all, I started hey, water. Hey, pink face is good, man. Pink face is when you know it's tasting right. Almost there. I'm, I'm not killing this shit, man. I'm on fire right now, too. That chili right there was, was the wrong move. You want to see the little bags we used to eat with the menudo? Break them up, hard ones open. Oh, yeah. Mm. <coughs> Ooh, that water's looking real good. We in, we in. The sniffles. The sniffles. You <laughs> keep looking at your water. I know, man. I'm crazy right now. <laughs> water does not help. The map is done. It's pretty good. I'd recommend this spot. Getting that water now, huh? Gotta stay hydrated. Well, as you guys already know, I already do recommend this spot. Every time I come in here, they treat me very well. We got a lot of delicious food, man. Come try some new stuff out. This is a, uh, what is it called? The Old Town Noodle House? Old Town Noodle House on 25th Street. Up here in uh, Ogden, Utah. Check it out. Thank you. Until next time.